Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. It's the final day of light season and I'm in a good position right now. Um, so I streamed last night to do arena, but that didn't take too long. So I played a double match after that in ether raids. So today we have two more double matches to play. I still have four ladders left. Uh, I think, yeah, four ladders left, and I've actually done the math, and I can technically take one death in both matches, although I'd prefer not to, but, you know, I might, um, and I can still make tier 39 that way. Uh, on defense, we got this three foes defeated in lift loss control, although it would have been minus zero anyway. I only needed two kills this week to get minus zero, and then we got a rematch from the person who I faced yesterday, and unfortunately that one didn't go so well. Um, so we'll take a look at that. There were also three other replays that I showed in my stream yesterday, so if you do want to see these, um, please check out the stream from yesterday. They would be near the end. Um, this one in particular, there was a plus 10 far save vector. Definitely worth watching if you've got a couple minutes. Um, so yeah, not much more to say, just, uh, gonna play Aether Raids. Just gotta do these two double matches. There's a Lin. Oh. Okay. Um, so there's odd recovery. That makes sense. Uh, here's what I'm thinking. I think Claude will do exceptionally well if I put him here where the face statue is. Um, oh, he's got return. Does he come with that or did they give him that? Also, this is such an interesting build. Um, anyway, yeah. We put Claude here. We near save with Lucas. I guess the only concern is Saul. Because if Saul comes down and attacks from here... Actually, yeah, no, I don't think anyone can dance him. So even if he attacks Claude, I'm not super worried about Claude. I think Claude's actually got... Mystic boost anyway, and anyway, he doesn't even have Dazzling Staff, right? So, uh, yeah, I think we're gonna stick Claude here. Um, he can take on Lin, he can take on Peony, Yoon doesn't reach, and he can definitely tank, uh, Sol. And then we, we near save, um, with Lucas to stop Elliewood from doing Elliewood things. Yeah. I guess he will be in Wings of Mercy range, most likely. Hmm. Okay, well maybe that's not the best idea then. So yeah, Claude will be here. Elliewood won't be able to lunge him. So Elliewood will be here when he is in Wings of Mercy range. And I think that's fine then. Claude can take on Peony. Claude can take on Yoon. I guess the only concern is... Actually, no, even if Nils comes in and dances Elliewood... Um, everyone should probably still be near saved. Can I actually make that happen? Claude here, one, two, three, four. I actually don't know if I can make that happen. Let's think. So Elliot will be here, then he can go one, two, three, if he gets danced. Uh... And he goes one, two, three, and he can attack here, here, here. So I think we can leave one person in the corner here, and I think they'll be safe. So yeah, I think we'll try this strategy. Oh, my, oh, my. oh there's a bit of a rally trap, isn't there? Does that change things? Hmm. Yeah, actually, do I even have a way to get everyone safe this turn? Oh, and there's also a... So yeah, he's the 7th unit, actually. So I think what happens is Peony comes down and dances him. Um, then he goes and rallies Lin and then gets danced, I guess? Or maybe he rallies not? But if he goes and rallies Lin and gets danced... He can go 1, 2, 3 and attack here, but I don't think he can attack here, actually. So I think whatever we had planned before can actually work um, even with Peony over here. Yeah, let's think about this one more time. So Elliewood ends turn, Peony comes and dances, because she's the only one who can. Uh, then he goes and rallies 
Actually, he can also rally Nils, but I don't know if he will. Um, if he rallies not, he'll do it from the place, which is probably not what they want. Um, I suppose he- oh, he might rally Peony. I see. So Peony would be here, then he would go here and rally Peony, then get danced. But then that's still fine in terms of a near save. So yeah, I think we're good. Leave it to me. Claude goes here. Yes. Break this with Freya. Maybe Peony lets Freya transform. I don't think it really matters, but... Actually, no, yeah, let's just leave Freya here. Um... Maybe break this. And... Do we want to break this? I don't really know. I think we're fine as is. Or might it be helpful? Yeah, it might be helpful to break this. Okay. And I think we're fine. I don't know if animations are on. I think they're probably off, actually. Definitely wasn't expecting that. Hmm. Yeah, wasn't expecting that. Oh, also, definitely wasn't expecting that either. Okay, yeah. Well, I just messed that up, huh? How fast is this Lin? How did she double my attack speed push Claude? Let's go for a stroll. Anyway, um, that obviously didn't go as I intended it to, so let's play another one. Is Claude not fast? Well, there's some. There are probably some debuffs on him. Um, okay, let's do another one. HP matching, I see. Melon float? Now that's gotta be a meme, right? Hmm. Armor smasher, but not refined. Um. Well, the HP matching means I can't isolate anyone, for sure. Who's the seventh unit? She can't be isolated either, that means. Is there ground orders or anything, though? Okay, well, there's... Uh, so there's Grey Waves or Gentle Dream, either of which would make her move three spaces. So I assume, then, what would happen is she would go down and return Celica. Um, does return heal? It does, right? Okay. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. Well, I think Micaiah would do reasonably well. I'm just definitely concerned about uh, this Celica. Because my near save unit is Lucas. And I don't think she does well against Lucas. Well, I don't think Lucas does well against her. Because she'll be quadding. So yeah, if she comes down and gets returned, she goes here, then she can go one, two, three, and she can attack all the way down to here. What if we just use double save? She's got Lance Breaker, but I feel like Brave Hector... Oh no, Brave Hector probably doesn't one-shot through her damage reduction. Or maybe he does? Hmm. Okay, what if we... Hmm, I was gonna say, what if we manage to get over here and snipe Peony or something? Um, or Azura, and then the other dancer would get baited. But I don't know if there's a way to do that in turn one. Or can we just kind of hide everyone? Actually, no, Celica... Celica's gonna be a threat. She'll be here, and then she can go one, two, three, and attack a lot of spaces. That's definitely concerning. Uh, and again, like, she probably just rips through Lucas. Actually, she has red and he has blue, so we might as well calculate what her attack is gonna be. So she's gonna have 53 attack, plus... I think Kia Staff gives 6, plus... 6 from this. Uh, let's, let's assume the max from Blade Session. It might not actually be, but... Um, and she, I don't think Joint Drive Attack would be active. 
So yeah, let's assume that. That's 74 attack times 1.5. 111 times 0 0.8 because of triangle disadvantage. Um, that's 88 attack. And Lucas has got how much defense? Doesn't seem to be that much, to be honest. Okay, so Mill is soaking Dark Shrine, I'm pretty sure. Let's, let's, actually, yeah, let's double check. 58 plus 38, 96 on Mila. He's got 51 plus 31. Yeah, no, that's not even close. So he's got 51 defense plus 5 from Mila existing, if I'm right on that. Um, plus 5 from Courtly Candle. Plus 6 from um, Sturdy Stance. Plus four from this. And then plus six from close defense. And I think if we buff him up as well, that would be an extra plus three. So he's got 80 defense. She's got 88 attack. Um, so that's doing eight damage per hit. You know, like, that's, that's really, like... Hmm. 8 damage per hit. She can't charge Moonbow though, right? Because I've got stance. So 8 times 4, he'll be taking 32 damage. I think he can take 32 damage. Um, and again, Moonbow can't charge. Yeah, Moonbow just can't be charged. The only concern is if Lucas doesn't one-shot her... Which actually he probably will because he has a two cooldown special, right? And she hits him twice, so he'll immediately retaliate with Moonbow. I don't know if he'll kill, but if he doesn't, um, I guess that is a concern then because someone can come in and dance and... Um, let's think. We would put Claude here, we put Lucas here, so Celica would end up here. Then Wings of Mercy would activate on Peony, but I'm pretty sure she'd get baited by Claude, and I'm pretty sure Azura would get baited by Claude too. So it's actually probably fine. Oh wait, no, sorry, not Azura. I would be using Micaiah, wouldn't I? Uh, sorry, not Claude, I would use, be using Micaiah. Um, does Micaiah actually bait... Um, Peony? Well, let's think. 46 attack plus 5... Plus seven plus joint drive attack is plus four. Uh, that's 62 attack times 0 0.8 because of triangle disadvantage. I'm pretty sure Micaiah has more than 49. Um, that's unfortunate. Well, um, yeah, if Lucas doesn't kill, it could definitely be a little bit concerning. Uh, but he can actually take 32 times... He can take eight times... Um, eight. He can actually technically take 64 damage if it comes down to it. Um, because only one of these two dancers will be able to Wings of Mercy in and dance. The other one is wasting their dance on Sarah. So Lucas actually can technically take all of that damage. So I think let's, uh, let's let Lucas and Micaiah do it. May the land be That's just my expert opinion, which could very much be wrong. Um, yeah. So, we're gonna put Micaiah 1 up. Uh, Lucas maybe stays where he is? Uh, we also can't isolate anyone, so it doesn't really matter where we put Mila. Um, yeah, Micaiah 1 up. Dagger, we'll probably move her down. Lucas stays here. Maybe Peony goes below him to dance. Um, and then Lucas is near saving everybody except for Freya, who is probably fine all the way over there in the corner. I'll draw them in. So she goes here. Lucas stays here. Dance. Lucas is now near saving everybody. Yes. Um, so yeah, we'll just let this happen. It's probably fine. Hopefully fine. At least I hope Micaiah can take on Bernie. Uh, well, we'll see. We'll see what happens. So we were expecting that. 
Okay, never mind. <laughs> That's just lovely, isn't it? Today's just not my day. She was off by two, and if I, that means if I had Peony's buffs, she would have killed. In that one hit. Well, that's frustrating. <laughs> uh, okay, two more ladders left. We'll do better on this one. And of course it's this kind of team. Edelgard in the corner. Um, no dancer, actually. Uh, no dancer. Everyone can reach to the bottom. That makes sense. So I think this is going to be a far safe strategy. Um, or maybe Micaiah can do it. How much damage would Micaiah take from Lolina? Is there any attack buffs? Tone Cavalry, so that cancels out essentially the sabotage attack. Um, so yeah, Lilina's got 72 attack. Well, 72 minus 7 from sabotage plus 6 from Hone Cavalry, that's 71 attack. And how much visible res does Micaiah have? 43 plus... God, I hate Freya bonus week. Like, this would be so much better if I had an extra, um, if I had an extra four res from, five res from air. But anyway, so she's got plus five from dagger. And then if we dance her, she gets another three. So that's 51. So she'll do 20 damage visible. Um, but then like zero after that. So yeah, I think maybe far save is the right, uh, you know. Actually, this is another Bernie, isn't it? So yeah, if I uh, if I take on this Bernie, I gotta really make sure uh, that Micaiah actually does kill. Because if not, we saw that she is really, really annoying. It's too bad that I don't have Mirror Stance on her. Um... Yeah, that's definitely concerning, because it's also a honed cavalry one. Well, actually, yeah, let's just see how much damage uh, Micaiah would do, because I want to know. Um, so she's got 55 attack, plus 3 from Freya existing, plus we're going to set it up so that she's got another 3 from Peony, um, Peony's column buff, and then another 3 from being danced by Peony. Uh, what else is there? We'll set up Binding Necklace as well. Um, not Binding Necklace, this one. Plus two from Mila. Uh, anything else? That, any extra attack buffs we could give her? Oh, she also gets plus five from Unity. And then I think plus five from this. Okay, so that's her attack. And then times 1.5 for Cav Effectiveness, times 0 0.8 for, uh... Color disadvantage. That's 91 attack on Bernie's. Um, uh, what's Bernie's res? 91 minus 23. Uh, what is that? 68 and then 30% damage reduction times 0 0.7. 47. That should be enough to one shot Bernie. Just barely, but it should be enough. So yeah, let's use Micaiah again. She needs a redemption after I messed that last one up. Um, we don't even super need to near save right now, just because... Um, there's technically no need for it. How far does Menace go? One, two, three, four... Okay, so we want Micaiah here, because if she gets menace, she doesn't she doesn't kill Bernie anymore. At least there's no dancer, that's nice of them. We take those small victories. And it's probably fine now. Like this. Let's go for a stroll. Yeah, might as well swap Lucas in in case some weird not shenanigans happen, but I just don't think they will. So yeah, let's see it.
Yeah, that's basically exactly what I was expecting. Oh, there you go. She also had Moonbow ready. Also, I forgot to turn on animations again. Um, let's turn on animations. Well, I think Dagger does reasonably well against these units. Dagger, or maybe not. Does she have no follow-up? She does, but my concern is what if... What if this one moves first, and then this one, and then he can go one, two... Oh, he can move really far. Let's just near-save everybody. If you say so. Or... You know, I know it's bonus for you, but it's also bonus not, so I don't super have faith. Um, yeah, let's just let Lucas near save everyone. Maybe let's... Does she get hit by that? No, she doesn't. Maybe let's break this. Uh, and yeah, this should be fine. He doesn't kill, but it's okay. Zeke also very much does not kill. That's also- he doesn't usually do that well against Nod. Hmm. Oh, and he only kills because of the Moonbow. <laughs> Damage reduction is- is actually really good. Who would've thunk? Um... Well, I want Micaiah to snipe somebody here. So maybe let's break this. Let's let Micaiah take out... Hmm. Um, yeah, I don't think I can get Freya in there, too. And she doesn't even kill, because she's not solo. Um, well, let's do this and then near save against the Zeke. Rest in peace. It's fine. It's a lot of damage reduction, sheesh. Uh, anyway. I guess we can try this. And then just near save with Lucas if it doesn't work. Okay, that's fine. Uh, yeah. Hopefully we can kill the Edelgard. Oh. Okay. Um. Yes. Right, boss. Well. Just you try. Uh. Got him. Good morning. Who do we want to kill with? I guess might as well kill with Dagger. I'm a little concerned about the Edelgard. And I, I hope Lucas can do it, but I'm not 100% convinced he can. She does also have Moonbow ready, which might help. Like, it'll definitely help, it's just like, does it help enough, right? Yeah, let's just move people. Um, I'm curious whether Micaiah can actually do it. No, she can't. Maybe if she had more attack buffs? Either way, we gotta get that. We can also get that, and I don't think it breaks Edelgard's uh, prison, or whatever you want to call it. Um, Let's go for a and... Like this. I think we want Lucas to... It will be you know... To, try this dish? to near save against her. Um, and I think he'll possibly be okay? I actually don't really know. Um... Care to try this dish? Let's go for a stroll. <laughs> I'm like so nervous. Uh Perfect picnic weather. Maybe we wait one more turn. Let's go for a stroll. Ready. Yeah, let's see what happens right now. Um No, she still can't kill. What if we dance? I'll draw them in. Understood. Draw them in. She probably still wouldn't be able to kill. Yes. So yeah, what if we just let we see what happens with Lucas? There's like no way she kills him, right? Understood. At least I'm pretty sure. Uh, well, we gotta get- we gotta let Lucas near save everyone, or else 
Uh, this will definitely be a massacre. Um, yeah, we gotta let Lucas be near saving people. Because otherwise Edelgard will go off on a rampage and kill people. Well, even if we lose one unit here, we're taking this. <laughs> That's good, but he doesn't kill. Just gotta hope she doesn't kill either. And I don't think she will, even with a bonfire. We know you are. Oh yeah, no. Okay, yeah, we're fine. Now Micaiah can finish her off. There you go. Cool. <laughs> Finally a win! <laughs> cool. Um, okay, so we got this one win. Now we just need one win um, where we can take a death. I am like 90% sure. Let me just redo the math on that real quick. 2668 plus how much do I make per match? 384. Yeah, no, we're fine. We can take one death if we need. Okay. Well, return's not going to work because of the healing tower, so I'm not concerned about that. Uh, this is a scary Bernie though. Oh. Okay. Um not Sarah, Bernie. Like, I would normally say that Claude can do well against this Bernie, but also I don't really know if that's even true. Um, who's the seventh unit? Her. Oh, so the guard dance is gonna happen too. Yeah, that's a little annoying. Hmm. At least we don't really have to worry about return again because of the healing tower. Um, oh, she also doesn't have her damage reduction, right? Um, if... If she's not... Uh, she's If she's at, like, 100% HP. Um, so Micaiah can definitely take her on. I guess we're using Micaiah again. <laughs> I bestow my blessing. It just makes a lot of sense. Um, unfortunately, I don't think we can get Micaiah up there to take on Triandra as well, but I think it's fine. Uh, I just realized we could have technically isolated Triandra, but then I think I'd rather isolate, um, I think I'd rather isolate Dorothy anyway, because we want Triandra to dance Bernie so that Bernie can go attack. Um, well, how do we want to do this? Oh, we want her here. Uh, so we definitely want Dagger out of the way. So I think this is fine. I think this will be fine. Freya can actually go here. Um, to transform next turn. And we'll leave Mila here because I'm pretty sure- Or actually, we can actually go up here with Mila, can't we? Um, she's still isolating. Yeah, I think this is good. Hmm, actually, does she not kill? Looks like she doesn't. Oh wait, no, but there's no damage reduction on Bernie, so... Um, she does kill. Definitely wouldn't have killed, um... If Bernie wasn't at... Oh, okay. Well, we... We definitely planned for that, so... That's nice. I didn't realize Eno would be, uh, you know. Oh, and he will kill with the Moonbow, I'm pretty sure. Okay, good. Hmm. Yeah, definitely good that we got that, uh... Why is she isolated? Oh, because she's she's in Cardinal Direction of Mila. That's kind of funny, actually. Um... Understood. Okay, well... Oh, she's tactics room, which is great. Oh, and we can let Freya take on Triandra. I think we can. So let's do that. Put Mila down here. And let Lucas near save against not... Actually, I don't really know if we want to. 
Um, how much in combat buffs is she going to get? She has minus 17. She's going to... Sorry. She, she'll she have a lot of stats, right? Can she take on Not? I just don't want a Wings of Mercy set up to happen. So yeah, maybe we'll wait another turn. Let's do this. Get him out of the way, and yeah. Might as well dance for you. There's no panic. So we'll wait one more turn for the other people. That is a little... Well, that's a lot of damage, but I'm pretty sure it gets super damage reduced. Yeah. That's good, at least. Okay, now can Dagger take take her on? She can. Wonderful. Um, so we do that for sure. We actually don't need the pots at all this time. Um, I'll draw them in. Understood. Oh, okay. Here's what I'm thinking. Um, Care to try this dish? Hmm. Actually, never mind. I don't know if I can pull it off. Um, or maybe I can. Assuming that we can take out Sothis, which we probably can. Understood. Yeah. And then Micaiah can definitely take out, or, or at least survive Sarah. She's got Mystic Boost. Yeah, no. Sarah's gonna be hitting for zero. So let's do this. If Sothis had, like, like damage reduction, I think she'd be a lot better. But she doesn't, so... Anyway, this is fine. Um, wait, does she not have a Dazzling Staff? Oh, I've got Nulsi Disrupt on my Mikai. I forgot. Oops. Yeah. Uh, I wonder if Freya can take out this Dorothea. Probably. Either way, if she doesn't, we can box her in? Or, or never mind, no, we can't. Um... Hmm. Well... Well, Micaiah definitely can. It's just like, getting to Micaiah, that's the problem, right? But we still got four turns, so whatever we do is probably fine. Let's do this. She can't quite reach, but she definitely will next turn. So yeah, we'll be fine next turn. Might as well get both pots since we can. Yeah, there you go. And now we can kill. Alright, cool. Um, so this week, the six ladders technically didn't matter since I had two left anyway, so I would add one left otherwise, but I will say it's definitely nice to have that extra cushion of one ladder. It feels- it feels better. Um, anyway, tier 39. That's definitely not gonna hold for top 1k since it's still early, but it's still nice to see. Um, so yeah, let's see how y'all did. Ooh, I'm up here with the- with the hard hitters. Heavy hitters? I don't know. Yeah, I mean, looks great. Congrats, everybody. Um, so let's watch the two defense replays. I haven't watched either of them yet, so saving the live authentic reaction for this video. <laughs> um, all right. Plus one Freya. Plus five bike, summoner supported. Dagger, Leon, Micaiah, and a plus six air. Wow. Hmm. I don't think Reinhardt can beat that bike. Oh my god. He doesn't kill, right? But... Um, bike also doesn't, like, kill either. Like, not even close. Oh, with the ether he gets close, but he doesn't heal anything. Um, hmm. So what went wrong, though? Because although Reinhardt's in Wings of Mercy range now, um, there's no dancer to come in and dance him. 
Yeah, that this makes sense. Okay. Uh, so they didn't lose anyone turn one. But the fact that he didn't kill Reinhardt was definitely a big concern. And the fact that Bike couldn't heal. No, Bike is super weakened. Oh, no, yeah. No, Reinhardt's gonna... Reinhardt... Oh, he's... Hmm. Well, Claude's also gonna have something to say about those flyers over there, yeah. Oh, and does she actually kill here? I think she actually does. And that's actually through Triangle Adept, isn't it? Does he take out Freya? I think it's... No, he doesn't, but... He gets close. And she actually can't heal. She wouldn't have healed much anyway, but... Um, now I assume Peony finishes off the job. Yeah. Even damage reduction can't save you from that one, unfortunately. Uh, so did they lose... That was three people? So they didn't lose anyone else. My god, look at the buffs on Dagger. <laughs> Be safe. Okay, let me get it. Um, hmm. Surprised Bike didn't die. I think he almost died. This year will be How did he not die from this? It's probably one off. Two off. Okay, cool. <laughs> and no pots. That's fine. I can't tell if your name is Iocomsi, Iocomsi, or Locomsi. I can't tell if that's an L or an uppercase I. Anyway, um, you've got a nice Eleonora. So let's watch this rematch from Pliss No. They brought along the same Lin that they had on their defense team, same Kemp, but they've given him a different build here. Uh, a far save Edelgard with special fighter, which I find really, really interesting. Um, Freya and Peony. So are they- are they trying to Gale Force or what? They didn't even charge Heavy Blade, right? Yeah, so that- Kemp is obviously dead, like there's no- yeah. Um, but what about the rest? Does he straight up kill? Oh, I think he does. Because she doesn't have the 80% damage reduction from Black Eagle Rule. Ouch. Oh, no. <laughs> Not this. I'm so sorry about this massacre, and I'm pretty sure Brammy's in Wings of Mercy range, and now Freya... Oh, Brammy was not in Wings of Mercy range. Oh, well. Uh, Freya takes out Brammy. <laughs> they dance. I'm sure they take out Not. <clears throat> Sorry. Mm. Um, but now it's not a good position to be in. So Claude takes out Freya, and now I'm sure Olwen takes out... Oh no, Claude takes out Peony. Claude has just been popping off lately. God, I really wasn't expecting that. Like, he used to be, like, the weak link, but really, Fire Sweep really made the difference. Um, I'm sorry about that, Plisno. I'm sorry that the rematch did not go successfully. I hope your season still ended okay. Um, okay, so yeah, that's it for today's Ether Raids. That's it for this season's Ether Raids. Let me know how your week went. I know this was a pretty rough week for a lot of people, so I hope it was okay. Um, and yeah, I may or may not see you guys tomorrow, depending on how busy my day is. But yeah, I hope you all have a great day, and bye!